Acids, bases and salts. Acids are the chemical compounds that are sour in taste. Acids are present in many things that we use in our daily life. Curd has lactic acid, lemon has citric acid and vinegar has acetic acid in it. Bases are the chemical compounds that are bitter to taste and soapy to touch. Bases are present in detergents, toothpastes and in hair dyes. We can test the presence of an acid or a base using acid base indicators. Litmus is the most popular acid base indicator. Blue litmus paper turns to red when dipped in acid. Red litmus paper turns to blue when dipped in a base. Red cabbage, turmeric and hibiscus are some of the natural indicators. Methyl orange and phenophthalein. These are the synthetic acid base indicators. Certain acid base indicators works with smell. These kind of acid base indicators are called as olfactory indicators. Examples onion, vanilla essence and clove oil. Reaction of acids and bases with metals. When an acid reacts with a metal, it gives rise to salt and hydrogen gas. When a base reacts with a metal, it gives rise to salt and hydrogen gas. But all metals may not react with the bases in the same way. Reaction of metal carbonates with acids. Metal carbonate reacts with an acid and forms salt, water and carbon dioxide. Metal hydrogen carbonate reacts with acid and it forms salt, water and carbon dioxide. So, all metal carbonates and metal hydrogen carbonates react with acids and produce salt, carbon dioxide and water. Let's see the reaction between acids and bases. When a base reacts with an acid, it forms salt and water. Reaction of metal oxides with acids. Metal oxide reacts with acid and forms salt plus water. Reaction of non-metal oxides with base. A base reacts with a non-metal oxide and forms salt and water. The common thing in both acids and bases. Acids and bases, when dissolved in water, they produce cations and anions. Cations are the positive ions and anions are the negative ions. When HCl is dissolved in water, it produces cations as H plus ions and anions as Cl minus ions. In the same way, if we dissolve sodium hydroxide in water, it forms Na plus cations and OH minus anions. Dilution. If we mix an acid or base with water, it results in the decrease in the concentration of ions per unit volume. This process is called dilution. Strength of acids and bases. All acids do not have same strength. In the same way, all bases do not have the same strength. We can know the strength of an acid or a base using pH scale. It has values from 0 to 14. The substances with pH 7 are neutral. The substances with pH below 7 are acidic and above 7 are basic. Importance of pH in daily life. The pH of water in water bodies is very important for aquatic life. Our stomach produces hydrochloric acid that helps in the digestion of proteins. Our tooth enamel can be dissolved by the acids produced in the mouth by the action of bacteria. Let's learn about salts. The chemical name of common salt that we use in our house is sodium chloride. It is the raw material to make many chemicals in industries. Chemicals made from common salt, sodium hydroxide, bleaching powder, baking soda, washing soda, plaster of Paris. Thanks for watching. Please like the video. Please share this video with your friends. Please subscribe to Great Booster channel. Press the bell icon to get all the latest updates. Check the description to find links of other useful videos. Check the end screens for our new videos.